I think that storytelling is a very, very powerful tool to bring humans to a common point of view. It is impossible to you know, force people to believe something or to agree with something unless you are able to tell a story and you know share that humanity. How we choose the stories we tell uh, really is based on the urgency of what's happening to our planet. We follow a scientific framework in which scientists are telling us if we do these handful of things, we can restore the health and abundance to the ocean. And so we try to tell stories about, they call them the recovery wedges, about more marine protected areas like um, marine national parks or protection of whales, or how do we stop plastic pollution from entering the ocean? And I think the most important story, Grazia, is just reminding people that the ocean is essential for human survival, that for millennia we have treated it as a dumpster and we have extracted too much from the ocean. But if we want to stay on planet Earth and we, I don't want to go with Elon to Mars, to Mars um, we need to take better care of it. So those are the stories I like telling. You know, it, it's it's funny, Gracia, because every time you get in, in the ocean, I, I feel that you're almost signing a contract that says you're now part of the food chain and you never know what's going to happen. So recently I had the incredible opportunity of spending a lot of time in the company of Southern right whales. These whales migrate between Antarctica, New Zealand, South Africa, and um, Australia. And they are truly wild animals. They're not used to seeing people. They spend most of the time in the Southern Ocean. And in most countries, uh, you're not allowed to get in the water with them because they're so endangered. During the whaling years, those whales went from 45,000 to 300. So when they became protected, now they're recovering and there's about 3,000 left. We got a special permit to get in the water with these whales and it is life-changing to see an animal that is so smart. It's the first time in my life that a whale, you know, oftentimes you get in the water and it passes very quickly and it's gone and you have to chase it again. Not these ones. These ones make a U-turn and it wants to come back and look at you. And it you know, has an eye that is almost human. And I was feeling, you know, I, I want to know what she's thinking. If I could talk to her and ask her questions, it'd be amazing. I, I think encounters like that just take your breath away. To tell great stories to save the ocean. <laughs> <laughs> that is our mission. But we want to be um, we want to be the agency for storytelling for the ocean, and we want to elevate the work of all the conservation groups out there.